spaceman. I always wanted you to go into spaceman. Stay tuned. Hey YouTube, it is I, Random Ross, and today this is a video response for Maya Angel. Now, like I say, every week, uh, Movie Phantom, well, he more like does it every other week, but every week, his girlfriend Maya, she does um, top three videos, uh, she picks a theme, she gives her top three of it out, and then she wants us to either let her know in the comments or on social media, or to simply do a video response like I'm doing right now. So, this week she asked, what are our top three space movies? Okay, now, this has not been an easy one for me, I can tell you that, Maya. Um, but it was so hard and I couldn't decide on just three. So I've sort of done, well, I've sort of done three. Yep, I have done, I've done two top three lists. So, first one is going to be space movies, top three space movies, and they are, number three, Galaxy Quest, sci-fi comedy uh, starring Tim Allen, Alan Rickman, Sigourney Weaver, Sam Rockwell, Tony Shellbound, Shellhound, you know, the guy from Monk. Um, number two, The Martian, starring Matt Damon. Uh, when he's left on Mars. But there are a lot of space travel elements in that film. Uh, number one, Star Wars. You know, uh, I can't tell you what my favourite one is. Because I don't think I really have a favourite one. Uh, if I had to choose, I'd say my favourite from the original is episode four. My favourite from the prequels, episode 3. And my favourite from the sequel trilogy, episode 7, because that's the only one that's been made. The other two are yet to be made yet. Okay, so I've done another one here. Top 3 space horror movies. I know, now, I wanted to do horror films. So, top 3 space horror. And number 3 is Hellraiser 4, Bloodlines. Um... The fourth film in the Hellraiser series, it's in the 22nd century and it's in space. And it has like, uh, reveals a bit of the Cenobite origins and stuff. Uh, number two, Jason X. Uh, now, this is probably not the best one in the series. I don't think New Line did Jason any favours. Um, but yeah, Jason in this one does have a lot more screen time physically. Um, but yeah, I like Jason X before it's awfully bad. Or, so bad it's good factor. Um, also, it's the last ever performance from Kane Hodder as Jason. And my number one sci-fi uh, space horror, Alien. Alien, that simple. Alien. So, um, I think you know why, you know. Space where no one can hear you scream. So, yeah. Alien. Uh, so, that has been my top three space movies and, movies and space horror movies. What are yours? You can either comment down below or check out my channel. As usual, I'll link it down below in the description. Along with links to my social media, Facebook, Twitter. Follow me on both those to stay updated on what I get up to outside of YouTube. Also, um... Yeah, be sure to like, share, comment and subscribe to my channel. And yeah, so. Uh, I don't think there's any more for me to say apart from till next time. Goodbye, friends.